Hook has been a part of Community East Hospital as a name, as an entity for a number of years. And um, when it came time to look towards the future, could we stay in the same space or could we move to another building? And, or alternatively, which is what we came up with, was building our own freestanding hospital. It was a bit of a challenge, you know, when we were determining where we were going to put this hospital and as far as the proximity to the uh, Community North campus. And it made perfect sense to put it in the location where we're at because it allows for the specialists who we may be consulting at various times to just come right across the street. It's gonna be a very easy relationship just given the proximity alone. I began realizing that my true interests were in physical medicine and rehabilitation, primarily because it was one of the few specialties where I actually could have the pleasure of seeing patients improving. Even if it's a small thing, it's those little things are things that we still celebrate. We have, um, you know, multi-specialties uh, that are going to be seeing our patients there. Obviously, because it's a rehab hospital, we're going to have the physical and occupational therapists, speech therapists, recreational therapists, all of which are going to provide their unique services uh, to the patients. We're going to have a variety of patients who are going to be coming in with multiple different diagnoses and conditions, all of which, you know, will affect their uh, quality of life, uh, their function. And so the goal with all of these uh, specialties is to maximize their independence, get the patients home in a timely manner, and be able to resume a normal life um, or as close to normal of life as possible. I'm dedicated to these patients. My goals for these patients are to maximize their outcomes as well. Um, we have therapists, nursing staff that have been with the community for 10, 20 years. It demonstrates dedication. Many of the times we're dealing with individuals who have had devastating injuries and, you know, and their life uh, as they know it has changed, but if we can restore some independence and some function to that, that means a lot. That's very important.